There we go. Hey there, everybody. Welcome back here. We're starting a little bit early, but today we finally have our first demo of Forza Horizon 4 for the Xbox One. Now, this is the Xbox Xbox One. Uh, this is not any X or, 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 or Xbox S, so this is what I wanted to see. Uh, when I went to PAX a couple of weeks ago, I was able to play the demo for Horizon, but it was like a really thin demo. I wasn't too happy with it. How you doing, uh, Big Sanic? Wyatt? Is ready yet? This is a single-player demo. This is out for Xbox One and PC. Uh, so, you can download it. It's 26 gigabytes. I'm not going to check it out on PC, as I have a data cap, but I don't want to download that extra 26 gigabytes. Holy shit, that's cool. So, supposedly, this is, like, the first, um, zone. Uh, okay. Uh, ooh, there's actually a colorblind mode. That's cool. Okay. Let's see, um... Oh, we couldn't change the names. Okay. I'm very curious if this is going to be like the demo they had at PAX, uh, then a little bit more, because this is a pretty big download. It's like still 26 gigs. How you doing, besties? Yeah, 1080p. It's still in 1080p, yeah? There we go. I gotta make sure. Yeah, it is. Okay. Yeah, why look at this look at look at all this this is rendered this is live rendering at at 4K right now. Look at look at the pixels on that steering wheel the steering right there. That is that is high resolution. Only through the power of the Xbox can you actually get this. How you doing, JX? Okay, this is new. This is new. Here's what I see. Oh, this is just the trailer, I think. I see a festival that never ends. There goes the copyright claim. Where you can be whatever you want to be. It's not your dream holiday So they announced that fucking Master Chief is in this game. This is kind of crazy. It's your dream life. Uh, so you can play, like, there's That's a mission the where you, like, fucking... I see. There's a, there's, you go to a ring. Let me show you. Oh shit, look, it ran into the fucking screen, Welcome dude. Welcome to autumn. A new beginning for the festival that never ends. Don't go anywhere. Horizon is How here to stay. Sweet, dude. Okay, let's, uh, let's turn on... Oh, wow. That's actually pretty sexy. Oh, wow. That is really sexy. Uh, let's turn on the... Let's remember, guys, ABS off, steering off. I'm really liking this already. Uh, again, if you're a fan of the channel and a fan of Forza, you know that in Forza 7, you, none of this mattered. But look like it looks like they've done that. Turn off traction control, manual, manual clutch. Yes, yes, we do. Uh, we always do braking. Um, we're going to do simulation tire wear for just a demo. I'm not a big fan of rewinding, so we've got that. Uh, drive guitar, I usually do above average. So this is pretty straightforward. I'm liking this a lot. Okay, what else we got? Let's do a name change here. Hi. Great Hi. to have you here. Oh, <laughs> I'm so sorry. I don't know your name. Um, she there was Curtis here last time. Wait. Where is it? God damn it. It's not here. Ship. Oh, these are all just like Oh, those are nicknames. Let's go to names. Wait, is there a cab? No, fuck it. We'll go to my name. Quality C. No. Wow, that's a lot of names. L. Are you kidding me? There's no Curtis in this? Oh. I'm literally clicking it. Holy shit, that's... Yes. Okay. Uh, name select. So we got that. Okay. Uh, audio. We're gonna... We're gonna have to turn off the music, guys, sadly. Do radio volume, yeah. Uh, microphone. We'll just turn it off. Shimmer mode. What is? Sh oh fuck! What is? Sh I hope this is what it means. Where like hell, like the music is off. Like any copyrighted music is off. So let's accept that. Okay. Uh, what else have we got here? 
Video, what do we got? Video. Okay, yeah, we got this. We got a colorblind mode, which is interesting. I don't know what that means. Uh, I don't know what that would represent. Maybe for like uh, checkpoints and kind of line. That's the first time they've seen that. Uh, pretty basic standard controls. Difficulty settings, we did that. HUD. You know, this is all your bells and whistles here. Analog, digital, units, blah, 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 blah. Uh, free roam, rewind. Huh. Change the rewind mode used while in Forza. Okay, classic and quick. We'll just leave that to default. Control settings. Kind of straightforward here. Um, okay. Let's rock and roll. Let's get back into the game. But that's... Okay, so what have we got here? Okay. Wow, this actually looks really good on the fucking uh, original Xbox. Looks really good. Now, in the demo that I played at PAX, again, I can choose between the, uh, the, uh, what do you call it? The, the Senna, I think that, uh, Jaguar, or, or the LaFerrari, Ferrari? I think it's the Ferrari, LaFerrari? Shit. And then a Porsche. I went with the Porsche. really nice now again this is the xbox one version uh the xbox one one not x or s so this is going to be 1080p 30 i've heard that it's locked at 1080p 60 if you have the the frame rate version on xbox uh, i'm very curious how the pc version will do um because the, the pc version ran fine it just crashed a lot also this was in the demo this is pretty much the demo right now what i played on pax um, I'm not a big fan of these buggy cars. They always feel like shit. But yeah, this actually looks really good. It is, I don't know, a little bit compromised compared to what I was playing. I want to check this out on my Xbox X. to get like, you know, what's the difference. But this looks really sharp. Again, 1080p 30. the Forza Horizon 4 demo. I really want to know if it's really easy. Because all this is is just a loading screen. I really like this demo uh, because of all sorts of different colors Alright guys, this will be easy. Just vote me for checkpoints and let's go. So again, we got a cockpit, and then a closer view on the cockpit. This was introduced in Forza 7, um, and then they just brought it back. They brought it in for Forza 4. Um, bumper cam, or no, 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 hook cam, bumper cam, uh, rear, and we then just lose yellow. on the quarry and the rain looks really good too they kind of cleaned it up a little bit in terms of like because it's like in forza 3 it was pretty nuts sometimes i like it a lot i'm fine it feels a lot better now that i turn like yo i like to have uh you know uh 
manual transmission, a lot of this, you know, the assist turned off. But this feels pretty good. Hey, Blue, thread the needle with me. But yeah, it looks really good. Red down, red down. Looks like I'm the only one left. That would be crazy if they actually introduced bikes to this. God damn it. It, Horizon. We are kicking off the summer season with the greatest race of all time. Point yourself in the direction of Horizon and put your foot down. Turn to the festival wins. So let's go. Don't sweat it. The Jets aren't in the race. They're just happy to be here. So I assume this is going to be like the first, you know, 30 minutes of the game, just like the Horizon. Oh, before. yeah. Drivers coming from everywhere. Now it's a party. God, this thing is like, I thought it would easily break 200 miles an hour. Oh, fuck. People are lining the streets Shit. to get a load of the action. Cheer these racers on, guys. Come on. I feel like if I was in a, a Centrudo, easily get this one. We got they say this game, this car is more of a, too. like, like, it doesn't drive like a hybrid car, but like a Citrino with, like, with the Senna is. Ferrari FXXK! And a beautiful Bugatti Chiron. And is that a Vulcan? Oh, Horizon, you do not want to miss out on watching this. Look at that Senna go! I mean, the car, sure, but someone's got to be handling that thing. How you doing, James? I'm doing good, dude. Final Check it out for the Horizon 4 demo Check for the Xbox me. One. So yeah, this time around, they got like more customization for the characters too, which is kind of cool. Like the stuff they had for Motorsport 7 was like, whatever. But this seems a little bit like, I don't know, more unique. Yeah, the music in this game, music in this game is pretty hot. Dude, that uh, that demo I played, I really enjoyed the music there. So at this point, the demo was completely done for me at PAX, and so this is all brand new stuff I haven't played yet. I really hope this is not copyrighted music, though. Quite a show. I try my best. Is everyone here? Yep, all here, boss. Ready and raring. Great. Okay, do we have Curtis here? Oh shit, dude! So they have the same models, I guess. I was, I was this guy, but we gotta go. Um, that guy. I confirm choice. This is the demo, hey, so it's nice like a slice. You. I mean, I'm if we want to talk about the, the difference between the betas and demos nowadays, it looks like I mean, you've made a good impression with our talent scouts. Like this one might have a real they're all chance demos. of taking a spot This on is what the game is going to be one of our when, you, when it ships. She's giving me a hand running the Horizon Road Racing Series. Excited? I remember my first day at Horizon. It's all pretty surreal, huh? I'll leave you two to get set up for the first race. Good luck. Right then, let's get you behind the wheel. There's a typo? Which one will Where? It be? God damn it. Ah, oh, shit. That's going to cost me. There we go. I don't know what you're talking about. I don't know what you're talking about, Anthony. Okay, so we got the coupe, fork, focus, and the charger. Of course we're going with focus. Nice choice. Maybe the hottest hatch on the planet right now. And designed right here in Britain, don't you know? Yeah, different nicknames and then uh, different names. They, the same thing that happened with, um, with uh, you know, Forza Horizon 3. You could choose nicknames and you could choose names. All right, let's get you set up oh, with a personalized number plate. Go on, be creative. We're just going to still call it Cuddle Kitty. The Cuddle. D. This way, yeah. What, Anthony? Was it two Ds? 
Why is it? Wait. Am I going the wrong way? Oh. L. How you doing, Fortnite? Spell it. Holy shit, how did we spell it? Spell it. I think it was like C C D E. Fuck it, we'll just do Horizon. We can chase it later. Oh uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought I had it. I expect you'll want to get a feel for your new car. So I've signed you up to some events to get you started. See okay. you there. So this is only a fraction of the map. I think it, is it going to be able are we able to zoom out? Okay. So this is the whole map. So for what I've heard is that the map is practically the same size as Horizon 3. That's crazy. So we got some urban stuff here. That's cool. Some industrial I wouldn't be surprised if some industrial shit is here too. That's really cool. I wonder if these are actual scans. We got a golf course. Okay, okay. There's supposed to be a quarry here too. Where is that? Oh, right here. This is gonna be a cool place to hang out. There's definitely a playground games here. Um, and then there's airport. Where's the airport? Where's the air here? Is this the airport? Yeah, this is the airport. This has to be an airport, yeah? Yeah, so you assume that's going to be where drag races are. How you doing, Bubble? Bubba? Oh, and there's some mountainous shit right here, too. Holy shit. They've never had mountainous um, terrain in uh, Forza. Blizzard Mountain was mountain mountainous, but they never had it in the full thing. Uh, it was always kind of like... You know, in Horizon 3, you would go up, and in, uh, you know, the... Like, the forest and all that shit was kind of up in the air. I'm pretty sure it's not going to be... I'm not going to be able to do that. Okay. Let's see here. I really like that pause. That's super fucking sexy. Okay. It's, okay. So, this is just a festival sprint. Basic sprint. Yeah, dude. It's pretty cool. Like, I pre-ordered it and stuff, but, like, I never always say never pre-order games, but holy crap. Like, I don't, I always expected this game to be really good. You know, the Forza Horizon 3 was really good. And after seeing what the, some of the streams and then playing that PAX demo, it's, like, really fucking good. Welcome to the Horizon Road Racing Series. Perform here and you'll be invited to more okay, events. Okay, we got tuning. Perform there. And someday, who knows? I might even find space for you on the roster. Uh, no, dude. If literally, if you did not say anything about a shout out, what a shout out you had, dude. Okay, so we got tune cars, options, anything new here, difficulty. Okay, pretty straightforward. Uh, okay. gonna be. I wonder if it, they... I'm really curious if there's still gonna be a lot of things from Horizon 3 that they're gonna carry over to Horizon 2, uh, Horizon 4. I'm not doubting. They just haven't been really talking about the, uh, kind of like the co-op stuff. How you doing, Airsoft? Thanks for stopping by. We're playing a little bit of Forza Horizon 4 for the Xbox One. This is the OG Xbox One. If anybody was curious. Uh, the again, the game runs at 1080p 30. Like, I don't, like, the driving in these games have always been good. Oh, there's Chow Chow. I forgot. <laughs> no, 
that's the one thing the Dravatars. I'm pretty sure, I'm like 99% sure they're literally just name placeholders. I wonder if they did any tweaking to the, uh, like the undercarriage of the game. Because, like, Forza 7 felt different compared to Forza 6. Yeah, they look great. Well, I mean, the thing is, is that all that stuff is, like, pulling in names from everybody. Yeah. Look, look, Jacob, I beat the shit out of you. <laughs> Get on my level. I guess, if you want to donate. Jesus Christ, eh? You don't have to time them out every fucking time. <sighs> For your first race at the festival, but yeah, if you want to donate nice through Streamlabs, you're Keep more than welcome like to, uh, more than welcome to, the welcome to the and I'll shout you out. Then your name will also be put into the ticker down below, too. I don't do super chat, uh, as that, I, as those things, that I would get the, I wouldn't see those funds for a while. Hello, I'm Anna, your automated natural navigation assistant. Yeah, JX, get on my I'll level. I'll help you explore the festival and right. find activities throughout the UK. Okay, Curtis. I have plotted your route to a new race in so, the like, Horizon Road Racing Series. It was really weird because when Forza 3 came hey, out, like, the, the connect was still kind of a yeah, thing. Stations. Or no, Horizon was it Pulse, was it Forza Horizon 2? Arena, so you could do Horizon a lot of voiceover party, shit. And Horizon XS. See what takes your fancy. In 200 yards... Okay, guys, this left, is a, this is a free demo left. if anybody wanted to check this out. Uh, right now, Game Pass is three bucks right now. Oh fuck, I am totally getting flagged. Let's let's do that. Uh, Game Pass is actually three bucks right now for a month. If you want to buy that, you get it for uh, a month. Game Pass comes with Horizon uh, 4, so you know. For that. You have arrived at your destination. stuff. I really like in the color scheme uh, too. It seems a lot better. Okay. So nothing, nothing interesting here. They, they've had that stuff since like what? Forza 5? It kind of looks the same. I, I think I don't remember Yeah, I think Forza 5 is what it is the start of this like current UI. I have it above average right now. But all that shit is just speed, yeah? Like, the AI never really, it's not really better, it's just faster. Forza 7's AI was so fucking bad. I don't know how it was so bad. Yeah, it does. Like, Forza Horizon 3 was also pretty good. It's really nice that they're taking it to, like, you know. England and shit. I really want to see what, like, the city looks like. Like, the rumor was it was going to be Japan, or, uh, Asia. Because, like, drift culture is really big in, uh, Asia. How are you talking about? Yeah, this is a single player demo too. It says it in the kind of the info dump. Why is there two 717s? 
You guys like we're gonna be out, man. See double. And of course, if you press down on the uh, D-pad, you get your telemetry. Get your, get your telemetry. Oh yeah, I forgot photo mode. Oh hey, what's up? Wait, why couldn't I see telemetry? Oh, what is this? Explore. Oh, okay, it's currently locked. Okay, settings, drone mode, quick chat. Oh yeah, and there's like quick chat and stuff. Toggle, activate. Is there no telemetry? Oh my god. It's not here. Oh shit. Wow, that's so fucking weird. That is really weird. Toggle Anna, toggle mini leaderboard. Oh, oh, oh yeah, 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 fuck that. Telemetry, never mind. There we go. I think that's what it was last time too. There we go. I'm loving the kind of the turquoise accent. Yeah, this is all the same. This is all the same. I really like how it just shifts it right into that white room shit. That's pretty cool. And I like this podium finish too. Looks pretty cool. You're supposed to be, you know, you will be able to customize your characters and shit. Uh, very similar to, to like Forza 7 did it. Let's, let's calm right. down on the, in the I chat guys about the changing your name. The Horizon Road Racing Series. How could I not with you driving like that? But it doesn't start until autumn. Can you amuse yourself until then? Yeah, just stop dude. If you're looking for attention, I could easily just snap you out of here. Wow, you really are the image of Frankie Beaumont. Sorry, she's kind of like Carter, Horizon Driver Relations. Now, do I have an opportunity for you? There's a movie shooting nearby that's in need of a stunt driver. Short notice, I know, but what do you say? Meet me here ASAP, and I'll introduce you to Mike Steele. He's a stunt coordinator for the movie. Sweet, dude. In 200 yards. How you doing, left. Super Saiyan Nova? Turn left. How you doing, nice man? 531 fucking roads. Holy shit, let's go a little bit off road. That is significantly more roads than there were in uh in Horizon 3. Holy shit. Oh shit. Hey, here we go. How's about how's about I put you in a timeout and then you figure out what's best for you? Route. In 200 yards, turn sharp left. Oh, there we go. Holy shit. Sweet dude. In four hundred yards, turn right. Totally fucked up the tranny on this thing. It's so great they get they got they got animals here. Turn right. Yeah, not on my watch. Uh, don't worry. 
Here they are. Future star of the silver screen. Hardly the doppelganger you promised. You having a laugh? They're like twins. Um, uh, so you can, uh... You'll do. <laughs> the fuck? Mike Steele, by the uh, way. Today's um, shoot's a getaway scene. If you, like, Head totally screwed up, you can just... We've got everything set up I don't know. There. The kid better be as good as you say. If you're in open world, you can easily turn that stuff back on. Right. Off to Broadway. And step on it, yeah? We don't want to lose the light. Oh, shit. I forgot the Bugattis are always a rocket. It takes us like a fucking two days to change the tires. Like a day to change the yo-yo in this thing. This thing is a fucking beast. You made it. That was yeah, dude. quick. Uh, right. Let's get everything set up. You're going in at the deep end. But at least you look the part now. This is a classic car escape. The hero's being chased by a jet and escapes by jumping through an old windmill. Don't ask. If you're as good as Joel says, this should be no trouble. Hey, kind of remember to breathe, kid. Just don't let it get away from you. I'll talk you through it. You'll be fine. Hook it left, but keep your foot down. Oh, oh shit, dude. Vehicle. So a lot of these showcases, I don't know, some of them are hit or miss. The one, yeah, the some of them were really cool in uh, so Rise what? 3. You just keep that needle in the red. Maybe do some evasive maneuvers. And the baddies overshot you, and our hero is safe. For now. Good. This is all good stuff. Oh, relax, shit, kid. I can't we're believe I held that. Keep it loose and drift. fast up the hill, then back down. Still got the jump to do. The road's blocked off ahead, so you're gonna cut across the field. They'll add something in post. Crashed alien ship or something. <laughs> it's all marked out for camera coverage, oh, okay? Post? You just line it up, floor it, and pray. Hey, eyes forward. Ignore the camera. Try to look heroic. That is a jump. Holy shit, that is a and jump. That is a wrap, everyone. Goddamn. Congratulations, kid. You survived. Did anybody else notice you that the fucking that roof of the of that uh of that uh job. of the car just like kind of crumpled up? Ignore the camera. We'll fix it both. Oh, continue. I like how it shows your banner too. Stunt driver. Okay. So is there like I'm Hey Curtis. There's a lot of rumors flying around that you've landed a spot in a new movie. Make sure you save time to take part in the autumn season when you're rich and famous. So many bars I gotta fill up. You've caught the eye of Alex, one of our Horizon superstars. He's looking for new racers to take part in the dirt racing series. Weird. I wonder if they're gonna like How you doing James? We're playing a little bit of Forza Horizon 4. Uh the demo here for the Xbox One. So far so good. I mean, if you're a fan of Horizon, you this will will be a pretty good game. Turn around when it is safe to do so. Oh, shit, this is pretty crazy up here. Hmm. 
Yeah, like, Horizon has always been kind of flat. It's cool that they have, like, a little bit more verticality. You know, you did go up the hill in, in you know, in the outback in the rainforest. It was kind of uphill. But none of it was, it was still kind of, like, flat, if you know what I mean. Thanks for stopping by, uh, Biggs. Can I challenge these guys? Did they add that? Okay. So, like, in Horizon 2, you can... I think maybe even... Yeah, I think it was Horizon 2. Horizon 3. One of the one of the Horizons where you can, like, just drive up to uh, driver tires and just actually race them, too. They called it head-to-head. -head. You can actually get some pretty good money from that. So there's, like, always something to do. at your destination. <sighs> uh, I don't know if I like that, like, kind of like the information through the load screens. I don't know. I think they're trying to be like more kind of tires. Come and see me after the race if you need anything know. else. Ah, it's you. I heard about the stunts you pulled for Joel. You know how to drive, don't you? Sorry, I'm Alex. I run dirt racing for the festival. Speaking of which, you'll need a car that can handle the dirt. Come on, fam. Okay, what do we got? We got the Escort, Impreza, or uh, Shredder. So, like, Mitsubishi is not even in this anymore. A lot of people are, like, it, a lot of people are nice. really weird about that. The Subaru. That flat uh, so, like, it's, that's is an now Toyota and Mitsubishi are two you. manufacturers that are not in this game. Toyota have backed out of Forza. I'm curious if they're in Toyota or if uh, in their Gran Turismo or Project Cars. Yeah, I always go with the Subaru. I'm pretty sure NF would, like, unfriend me if I went for it with uh with something else. <laughs> they are using the British style, which is interesting. It's on the right side. It's on the left. Okay. First dirt race coming right up. You go and enjoy yourself out there. Um, so the, they, no one has officially said why, um, but the rumor is that it had to do with, for Toyota, they were worried that people would think the games were too realistic. Um, I've also, I've also heard, like, some people say that maybe because they didn't want to have their vehicles damaged, look damaged or something, I don't know. There's nobody has officially said anything. is actually reminding me of Horizon 2. Yeah, you, you should definitely check it out, uh, Sanic. It is free. It's 25 gigabytes. It's on the Microsoft Store on if you have Windows 10. Oh, you have an Xbox, don't you, Sanic? Yeah, I forgot. Yep. Do I like the setting? Uh, yeah, I think it's pretty cool. It's really cool that they're they're doing it in uh, UK or Britain. It would have been really interesting to do like Asia, which was like possibly rumored a little bit. And some leak concept art. 
I really, the world hasn't changed for me. I want to see that. I want to see that in game. Yeah, the sounds have been really good. I guess I was watching one of the streams on Mixer, and I guess like one of the producers was like, uh, you know, if you listen to the Senna, that is literally me holding up a boom mic to uh, to the Senna. I'm like, that's fucking cool. Because like all these are recorded with high quality mi microphones and shit. Like all these sounds are, you know, generated. Somebody had to get this car and, you know, drive it. Or, like, rev it up. I am using earbuds, so it's really hard to figure out, you know, if they do sound better. The sounds are always pretty good in these games. Wow, I smoked those guys. I always find it weird, like some races you're like pretty close to yes. first or second, first race and then other teams, the other races you're like just How do you feel? way far ahead. Dutty. Brilliant. I think you could go far in my dirt racing series. Perform like that again, and you may just make it into round two. So there's like, there, so we're saying dirt racing and then stunt racing. That's interesting. Looks like you've nearly qualified for the autumn season. And remember, the more driving you do, the more you'll build your influence. You usually get uh, loose. How you doing, MGJ? Hey, I'm hearing good things about you. Oh, sorry, my name's Jay. I might have something that'll interest you. There's a street race meetup, and I think you should check it out. See you there. Oh, there's a billboard right here. I, I'm curious if any of this stuff is carries over. In it's in the settings. What is it? Settings. Difficulty. And then it's the top setting. So I usually do it above uh, average. Um, and then this usually... ABS is the only kind of, you know... System that I turn on. It's assist. Use normal. Traction control off and stability off. Um, I do love this pause screen. This is, like, so fucking cool. Because, like, it's still moving. The car is still moving. That's so fucking cool. But if you go over right here and it zooms back. And it's fucking... It's a seamless. Look at that. That's so fucking cool. That's cool. Recalculating route. Shit. Where is this guy? It's uh, the second. Uh, the second is the official release. I like how you can just rolls over that. How are we? Oh, there you go. So, Kira told. about these smash a fast travel board and you'll get a discount on the horizon fast travel service i don't know ice man i really don't know and the festival will cover your cost completely because like some of this stuff this adventures. might just be like is this a one-way fucking road okay no. uh -huh. it just might be like the first like you know hour of the game so what's the point of putting in billboards Safe to do so. Here he is. Recalculating oh. route. Okay. In 100 yards, turn right. In 200 yards, I really yards, like you just break right left. through these stone, stone uh, fences. Turn 
turn left. In 200 yards, turn right. Turn right. Oh, this is cool. Yeah, it was like, like Horizon 3 didn't have a lot of you urban development. Your like they had Byron Bay and for like quiet urban racing and then they had Surfer's Paradise for your like, you know, Metropolis racing. But that was pretty much it. What I liked about kind of Forza Horizon 2 was there's like kind of scattered across the map was like little towns that all had different like kind of tracks and shit. Uh, no, there is no water level. There's no cops. There's no cops and robbers type of thing. You ready? Ready? Let's do this! Um, there were trucks in Horizon 2. Oh, it's you. You made it. I'm Jay, by the way. Like, are we Alex talking about truck trucks, about or what are we you, talking you know, about? If you drive half as well as he says you can, these guys I'm will love sure you. I'm pretty sure there oh, there was trucks start, in Horizon know, this 2. Is strictly not sanctioned convinced. By I don't, the I'm not sure about so Horizon 1. Don't mention one. this to Kira. All right. I gotta go. Work to do. See you around, though, yeah? These might not be official, but you keep coming to these meets. I'll make sure everyone at Horizon knows your name. Looking forward to seeing what you can do out there. Okay, Have fun now, yeah? It does seem nice that you like, it's not really showing you, hey, you have to do these events in like these cars, like in seven. Seven was kind of like criticized for that, for like, yo, you have to do, you, like in Horizon 3, you could practically play the whole fucking game with just one car. It was pretty crazy. You would never want to do that because you want to definitely get more. I played a shit uh, out of two. Again, it was gold last month, which I do recommend if you haven't played a Horizon game before. It's still a good game. Though if you compare that to Horizon 3, it is a little bit archaic. Like how it handles fast travel is really weird. Yeah, er, yeah. The, the, anim the idle animations look a little bit weird, Zanik. But this is a racing game. You're not going to expect high-level models. Very curious about like the settings you can have in online and uh, online setting up like hey what time of day I'm very curious about that I wonder if I could literally just toggle do this race but in winter I'm very curious about that very curious about that that's my like biggest okay setting up for like races you could change like the time of day you can have a rolly you can have it fixed uh, you can have it uh, Raining, two different rains, foggy, cloudy, uh, you know, post rain, all sorts of different settings. I'm wondering if you could do that, but then also have like, hey, it's winter, it's autumn, just like that. Oh, are we talking about like big, huge, like you know, like mat trucks, semis, lorries? Then I don't think so. I don't think those are in this game. If we're talking about lorries and trucks. So, street racers have all these unspoken rules about respect and honor and who can and can't join, but all you need to know is, drive like that and you're welcome anytime. But yeah, uh, on the whole customize, the whole character stuff, you're, you're supposed to have complete, like, your customization of your character, like head. Uh, I think I even saw them talk about different hairstyles, eyes, uh, shirts. Uh, pants and um, shoes. So there's a lot of customization I heard about this game. Hey, 
Just to let you know, there's another round one dirt race starting soon if you fancy it. See you there. Oh, and me and Jay have just finished setting up a new danger sign. You should check it out if you fancy some thrills along the way. Check out the danger sign. Is there other sign, uh, horn signs? Okay, no, there isn't here. Tune setups. Okay. Okay. Drag strip. Okay. Wait, wait, what is this? Okay, that's not even. Okay. Yeah, the horns in uh, Horizon Two were pretty nuts. Horizon Three, Horizon Three, I should say. They got like really crazy with some of the horns. Let's do this danger and we'll go to the festival. A lot of kind of gravel road here too, and that's kind of cool. Nice, dude. You have arrived at your destination. These will I can it up never really do hazards. these that well. Then me and Alex went around to pull Oh, I already bought the full version, uh, Ivic. Voila. I've, it, I have already bought the ultimate born. edition. So long as you survive? Nope. Okay. Let's go here. Can we fast travel here? Not, not yet. Shit, it's right over here. We're just gonna do this. Probably let us build more. I'm actually gonna turn off the collision. The, uh, the simulation. I think the problem with this game when it comes to collision and shit is you take, you kind of take a lot, especially in off road. All that shit is going to bust your car open. There we go. Let's do that. Turn yeah, it, it's out, Aaron. It's it. out. It came out early today. This is the Xbox One version. Calculating route. We've been playing that for the past uh, hour. I'm having fun. Like, I'm really pumped for this game. You have arrived at your destination. I mean, you can turn it off online. Uh, if you ever, well, Iceman, if you ever watch our uh, Forza Sundays, we usually turn that off through the settings. Uh, so, again, when. You see me going all through these spots. These are like races you do. Um, in standard, in Horizon 3, they made it so like you could add like different settings. Uh, when you're online, you can turn off collision. And you can turn on teams. I never do teams because that shit is broken as for me. But yeah, you can just turn off collision. It's really good too because usually the first corner is always the pain in the ass. It helps a, a, a lot against like really shitty people or people that don't really know how to drive. I feel like people can focus on trying to get the fastest time. Uh, that is a multiplayer only thing, not in a, a not in the single player. I think it actually might be working co-op, but I'm not sure. There is an, uh, there is a rewind function, but that is for the free roam, I think. I don't think that's going to be for, like, races. I don't think online races events will be different. seen any perk system too so they they fully flushed out that even more where some cars actually have a perk system so i'm very curious about that i assume it's just like hey you get more points it's the horizon edition stuff like hey you're gonna get you know x amount of credits more for these cars this is kind of cool
I really like the gravel. It feels really nice. You can, I can definitely feel the car lose a little bit more traction compared to being off road. I'm always down for some dirt uh, races. Like I was, I'm a big fan of rally, and so this is this is hitting me where I like it too. Like a good old, there was never really a good rally cross, like full uh, kind of dirt track in uh, in Horizon 3. A lot of it is kind of road, uh, which is ironic since Australia doesn't have much road. But you would you would see like these off road places or off road sprints. Uh, kind of be like 80%, 90% fucking pavement. It was just really weird. It was really weird. How you doing, William? Right. Good news is you've made the cut for the Horizon Autumn season. Okay, what is Bad this? news, obviously, is that it doesn't start until autumn. You don't mind sticking around, do you? <laughs> oh, God, that would be hilarious. I, I wonder if that's the demo. Okay. Congratulations for playing. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. So I am unlocking cosmetics. You have unlocked the exclusive reward for the full game. Okay. Yes, it is. Uh, I'm... Remy Shucky and oh okay we're no we're continue we're continuing yeah we uh yeah this is the demo your new car has been added to garage okay what we got here anything new oh so we have some more um so these are speed zones um drift zones kind of pretty straightforward stuff a little bit of different iconography uh this is a speed uh trap so you come through here do an x amount of speed uh, but I assume that's the demo? I don't see anything else. Okay, let's uh, head back to the... I want to check out the festival. God, thank you, Curtis. Yards. Thanks, Turn William. Left. But yeah, the demo is out. Xbox One. Play the, or Xbox One and PC. Turn Does left. support Xbox X. If you got that, yards. there is a, Turn you know. Left. Turn left. Dude, is it really pulling in data already? Oh, God. That's hilarious. That's crazy. It's already pulling in data that JX is playing. In 400 yards. Turn left. Yards. Turn right. Okay, we're gonna check out the festival and then I wanna see what happens with the once we hit the edge of the map. I'm wondering if this is like literally the whole map. I wouldn't be surprised. I wouldn't be surprised. You got some shitty internet, uh some guys. yards you will arrive at your destination it is a big change from horizon 2 which had like very kind of like it was horizon 2 was kind of your the color in that game i don't know what do you call it it's kind of like bleached out a lot of color is bleached out this is the first time they've had out like a the a central hub they've always been in like certain areas so it looks like they're doing away with the the hub stuff. Okay, we got upgrades. So, it's a garage. Game obviously, team, games team. It's where you come okay. to work in your cars. Body kits makes sense okay. so far. So we still have body kits. This is already installed. Um, barnyard finds, of course, always here. Customizations. Oh, car horns. Here we go. Musical. Oh shit. That's cool. Yeah. And 
And then this is this is the my favorite. Different kind of horns. These like actually sound like car horns actually kind of doing their thing. Okay. What is the difference between the colors? Okay, what do we got here? What the fuck? I love me some good synth. What the fuck? Hyperdriving game. Yeah. 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 Some bass. Holy fuck, dude! Oh god! Oh god, they have the fucking Windows XP sh <laughs> They literally have the. Holy shit! Oh god, I need that. I need that as my horn. That's fucking hilarious. Oh shit, what is... Okay, that's Hooter. That is fucking... That's great. That is just fucking hilarious. Holy shit! Oh god, that is... Oh god, that is hilarious. Just... So a lot of these were kind of Forza Thons, and a lot of them you kind of unlocked. I think there was... I'm very curious how they're doing it this time. There was actually something you could download or buy for like five bucks to unlock all the horns. I don't know. Okay, what else we got here? So we got favorites. So these are cars. Okay. Okay. My cars. Um. So they do have that rarity thing like they hit in 7. Um, I'm actually really like this. I'm curious. Okay. This is... This is actually really smart. One of the problems I had with Forza 7 was, like, it was constantly loading in these high-resolution, high-polygon count models, so it would take a while for it to load. Uh, this, it seems like they're just kind of just, hey, we're just going to do 2D art, which is fine, and then have it, like, vertical. That's... This means, like, so if I want to go to Ford, I just go over here, and then here's all my Ford. Uh, you know, here would be all my Dodges, Audis. Uh, that's actually really fucking cool. Let's check out the center. Uh, let's get in. How you doing, Joss? You're buying all the horns. Okay. Um, let's rock and roll. Oh, uh, no. I don't like how, like, you get in your car and you uh, press A and it kind of, it just sends you into, like, the workshop. So where is the edge of the road? I'm si I'm assuming it's like right here, like because this is this is all new stuff. Let's actually go to this free this road right here. Yeah. Turn around when it is safe to do so. In 400 yards. God, look at that fucking turn thing. left. Think massive. Oh, shit, it is safe way. to do so. Recalculating route. How you doing, Josh? Oswald. Welcome to the stream. We're playing a little bit of Forza Horizon 4, the demo. We're kind of done everything. So right now we're going to see what's actually in this, like, fully in this game. I'm surprised there's, like, not a championship. It's all just exhibitions. Exhibitions. Yards. Turn left. Uh, it, it's not in the demo, but I did see the video. Fucking 
jump this way. Not bad, not bad. Recalculating route. You're in the top 100. Cool. Cool. In 200 yards, what the fuck does that mean? Left. So yeah, one of the newer things they added is you can buy houses, which is kind of crazy. I'm very curious how they introduced that. Thanks, Josh. at your destination. Okay, we're just gonna follow this road straight. This leads into the freeway. Let's see how far the this fast this baby can get. Ah, hey! Oh, no, that's the edge. That's the edge. Oh, only limited to a six. Okay, yep. I'll show that. So that's that's cool. Um, we're then let's check out the. Uh, I want to check out the. Uh, so it, it seems like this whole area is sectioned off. We'll check out the um, amp. Does anybody want to see anything else? Other than that, we're kind of done here. But yeah, this is um. I wonder what this is. There's some shit here, too. That's cool. Oh, this is going to be cool. Nice industrial area. I bet Fugan's going to like this. Because um, he was kind of like... He really liked the... Uh, the kind of the industrial area in Horizon 2. That, like, really wasn't touched. It had some shit you could do there, but it wasn't really touched. Um, so he was going to like that. Like, the there's a lot of cool industrial areas in Horizon 2. Uh, it's kind of funny that they leave these bridges here. It's weird. It's weird. Conor McGregor, Jesus. Um, imagine if you can go to Australia if you had three. That's an interesting thought uh, because of the uh, like in Hitman. It, Hitman uh, Two is coming out, and if you have Hitman One, you can actually replay all of Hitman One in Hitman Two, which is kind of cool. Okay, we're just gonna chill on the road and head to this, uh... Jesus Christ, Jax, calm down on the road discoveries. That's crazy that I, that's updated, like, right now. Judging for life. In 400 yards, turn left. Turn left. How you doing, Charge and Johnson? Oh, there's even like road through, like a like a little path maybe here too. like these these games where they like take place in some sort of fictional like semi fictional area I always thought like because they have to send a crew there to like explore the area so I, I always thought like you know just a team of guy developers going out here and then having a guide and a guide guide them through these area and just talk about the history and shit just like making notes there's a, there's a famous um Paleolithic kind of structure in in this area called the White Horse. It's been around for like three thousand years, and that's in this game, which is kind of cool. I actually watched the video about it uh, a couple months ago. It, that's crazy. Oh, is this? Oh, okay. Oh, that's a lot of salt. Okay, cool. Which season do I like the most? Uh, winter because it's cold. How you doing, uh, Mohammed? Yeah. 
You always forget that the AI is so fucking dumb in these games. In 400 yards, turn left. Is there another one over there? So in the free realm, I read that it is a we a monthly thing. So the the event the the seasons take place over a course of the month. So you know, like uh, the first month will be summer, and then the second month will be fall, and then the next month the next week I should say next week. So that's pretty cool. Uh, I'm still very curious if you could do that on the fly. Turn right. Yeah, it is a just a demo. Turn right. Oh god, this is reminding me of uh, Burnout Paradise. They had this. In 200 yards, turn right. Yeah, this demo is really cool. What the fuck was that? Did I just. Did I. Did, did the game right. bug out? Yeah, like Burnout Paradise had this kind of thing. There's also some ramps here and shit. That's crazy. This is the demo. This is the demo, uh, Joey Escobar. We kind of just wrapped it up about five minutes ago. Uh, there's not much to do. It's presented with, what is this? One, two, three, four, five, six different races uh, from different disciplines. Kind of a, uh, you get a kind of a sprint, a couple sprints. A uh, dirt race, a two dirt races, and then some showcase type of stuff. So one's a stunt driver, one's a street driver, I guess. Yeah. But other than that, it, there's not much here. No, they don't, Danny. Or, no, they don't, Static. No, they don't. Um, if you saw like the PAX demo, which is literally the E3 demo. This is... So, you're presented with, you know, the set on, then you're gonna go race through the, um... Wait, they didn't... No, yeah, okay, so you go summer to fall, fall to winter, and then winter to spring, and then you get control, and then you're dropped into the open world. But yeah, I'm really hyped for this game. Um, realistically, my only, like, kind of what are they going to do is, again, if you watch any of my content on, I do on Sundays, the Forza Sunday stream, where I, like, you know, road discoveries. I wonder if that's score? Where I kind of, like, set up races and shit. I, I'm very curious at how that works in this. I wonder how championships are going to work in here, too. Uh, they talk... The game, they don't, they talk about one festival, like, right here. Like, the festival site. Is this one giant festival? Is this... Because in Horizon 3, you had, you had a, you created a festival in By, uh, Byron Bay. And then you created a festival in, um, near the dam, then the Outback, or, 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 and, uh, then in, um, Surface Paradise. This seems to be more in line with Horizon 2 and 1, where there's one centralized site. I don't know where else it could be. I guess it could be also here, too. Um, maybe maybe something over here, too. I don't know. And I bet this, I bet this one over here, too, somewhere. Maybe over here. Maybe. Maybe. Yeah. Well, it's a hypercar, uh, Big Bird. It's a hypercar. I don't know what you can do with it. If anybody wants to see a couple cars, there, there really isn't many cars in here to show off. Yeah, I'm I'm really hyped for this game. If I didn't have a data cap, I would totally download this on PC and pop up my racing wheel. A lot more dirt roads in this game. A lot more dirt roads, which is kind of interesting. Forza Horizon 3 did not, or, yeah, 3 did not have a lot of dirt roads. Mm -hmm. 
Again, this is standard Xbox X. Um, looks pretty good on the Xbox X. You know? I, I, I'm still blown away that they're able to do this. Okay, we can, we can take it in off-road. Can we pick a car here? Um, change car. Is this going to cost anything? Let's see. Um, should we do it? What is it? Is this an all-wheel drive? No, this is a rear-wheel drive. Okay. We'll do it in the Impreza. Okay. The RS is the uh, is more of a kind of a hatchback, not really off-road. I think it's only a front-wheel drive. Okay, that's deep. That's the deep end. It is? It looked like it was all front wheel drive. Oh, yeah, it is all wheel drive. Yeah, we can check that out. I'm curious if they are going to keep it where... Because, in again, in Forza Horizon uh, 3, you actually had to pay money to get your car delivered to you. Very, it was like an open world, but you stayed on the road. Sometimes you would go a little bit off-road, but it was dirt road. Horizon 2, they introduced kind of more off-roadness, but still kind of some stuff was segmented, uh, like going to the, the airport, uh, the difference between the coast and shit was off-limits. In Horizon 3, they even opened it up a little bit more, except for one little section. I'm wondering what's logged off here. That's a pretty sweet spot. You can kind of see like the clouds a little bit moving over there. You spent three million on deliveries? Jesus Christ. Yeah, deliveries can rack up, dude. Porsche's in here full time, um, so you're not going to have to buy an expansion pack anymore. One thing that I really, really liked was, like, they kind of had it in Forza, uh, in the Hot Wheels, was, like, you could change a little bit of the car for a little bit of the race. So in Hot Wheels, if you ever played it, it was... There's certain segments of the race that would like have like a loop or it would rotate or it would like be a corkscrew loop or just kind of a straightaway or just like a, you know, barrel roll loop. You could change a little bit of the race. Um, I wanted that out of this. Uh, I'm just curious of how hard that would be. Like making your own races would be pretty cool. You could do that in Grand Turismo 3 or Grand Turismo uh, 5 and 6, but it was very limited. Really good popping through those walls and shit. I'm really glad they're not really hard. One of the things I learned from Burnout Paradise watching like information, uh, like especially when that remaster came out, 
the thing you want to do when you make an overworld racing game is make sure to... The, what the fuck? You can actually see in that. Make sure the player is not running into clipping into anything. It was pretty bad in 2, especially when you're going through towns. But in 3, it was pretty smooth. I, I, I guarantee you this has to be a, one of the houses. Thank you, bye. Let's see what we've got in here. This is somebody's house. This is totally somebody's house. I think that's it gonna be it for me, guys. Unless you guys want to see something different. I expected this to be kind of a short stream and just show off a little bit more of the game. Uh, I was really hoping that you'd be able to change like winter and summer and spring and autumn, but that might be like a whole. That's a, like a literally you're loading in a whole nother map. So I bet, I bet that shit's kind of hard. Um, nah, it's a little late for GTA right now, Planky. But anyways, guys, thanks for watching. We'll be here tomorrow with Rainbow Six Siege again, or maybe GTA. I don't know. I need to... I'm picking up my parents at, like, 3 or 4. They said at 3, but I don't know if they're getting on the ferry at 3 or getting... Arriving in Seattle at 3. Um, so keep around out for that. Um, but yeah. But that's it for me, guys. This is Forza Horizon 4. Really enjoy this. Join me um, every Sunday for Forza Horizon 3. The 26th, we'll be doing our endurance run, which everybody's welcome to join. Then uh, Thursday at 9, we will be playing Horizon 4 for the Xbox One. And that's it for me, guys. I'll catch you on the next one. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Follow me on Twitter, at Caboose 97 for the latest and greatest. Join our public Discord. Let me get the link down for the Discord if you are haven't joined it yet. Great place to chit chat. I always use the usually post stuff there. Like I posted that this demo is out. Uh, like there was rumors that this was coming out, but nobody said anything. And then like a Eurogame article said, "Hey, yo, this is coming out today." And then then um, it was like, "Yeah, it's out." But anyways, guys, see you guys later.